Okay, so I'm Cheyenne Atkins and this is lab one for bullet trajectory analysis. This lab was very, very hard to do and I'm not sure if I did it right, but here we go. Okay, so <clears throat> when I use my ruler to find a major and minor axis of the bullet hole, my bullet hole minor axis was 19 millimeters and my bullet hole major axis was 13 millimeters. The angle of the bullet impact, I got 43.17 after using the equation sine zero minor axis divided by major axis. I got 43.17, which was 43 degrees. Let's see. So, let's So, in order for me to find an approximate shoulder height of the shooter, I basically, after doing research, came up with a triangle, whereas it had to equal 180 degrees. So, what I did was, it was basically A plus B plus C. So, my A was my... 40 degree, 43 degree angle of impact. And then I had 90 and 180. So what I did was subtract, I did 180 minus 90 minus, 40, minus 43, which was my angle of bullet impact. And when I got that, I got 47. which is 30 feet and 11 inches round up to four feet tall. So the suspect was four feet tall, which does not sound right at all to me, but that's what I got. 